Well, now at noon, five people are hurt, including four firefighters after a three-alarm house fire in New Jersey. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Jim Donovan. And I'm Rahel Solomon. Everyone injured is expected to be okay, but as I News reporter Trang Doe shows us, it took crews in Trenton several hours to get the raging fire under control. A century-old home up in flames on the 900 block of West State Street in Trenton just before 1 this morning. I was in my bedroom, and it was like an explosion. And I looked out my window from the third floor of my house, and it was just flames next door. The massive 5,300-square-foot home was subdivided into four apartments. Eight people are now displaced, including property owner Bruce Keys. It started in that bedroom on the second floor, inside the wall. It came, the fire came up through the wall. And then it went right to the ceiling, and the whole ceiling caught on fire. Everyone got out of the building, but one tenant had to be rescued from the second story roof. Paramedics transported him to the hospital with smoke inhalation. Barry was trapped on the roof right there. I ran back and got the ladder and got him down. He's in the hospital right now, but he's all right. Two firefighters suffered minor burns searching for anyone who may have been trapped inside. Two other firefighters were also hurt responding to what was a very challenging fire. These houses are um, extremely old. The, the wood in there is extremely dry, and some of these houses get chopped up into smaller units to allow for other residents to live in. And it makes it extremely hard to get in there and to get to the seat, to the seat of the fire. Tenants and neighbors comforted one another as they watched flames and smoke consume the once stately home. Investigators are looking into a cause. From Trenton, New Jersey, I'm Trang Doe, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.